Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the vlog. Hope you're having a blessed day. If you're new to the channel, I'm Steve Chapman. Today we're going to do a slightly different video than normal. As you know, the Sixth Sense Access and the 13 Fishing Jabberjaw are two of the hottest lures to come out this year. This, in fact, this summer. Two of the hottest and hardest baits to get your hands on. Now, they have a lot of similarities. Both are patent pending, innovative design, unique, and again, they're insanely hard to get uh, to get your hands on. But today we're going to look at the similarities and the differences so we can find out which one is the best bang for your buck. Is it the access? Is it the jabber jaw? We're going to put them heads up. Today, mano y mano, access versus jabber jaw. Which one will win? Which one will be the greatest lure that's come out in years? Well, probably not the greatest one in years, but which one has been the hottest bait of the summer? But before we get started, let's talk about a few things that both, both lures offer. The Axis and the Jabberjaw are hybrid crankbaits. Both have a metal square bill that goes side to side to give both an erratic hunting action when they're reeled in. Both are meant to be part crankbait, part bladed jig, but also have the sound of a chatterbait because that is one of the positives about a chatterbait, the sound it makes in the water, the metal clicking. So both the Axis and the Jabberjaw are designed to have that sound. Both are, uh, both are designed to dive up to two to five feet deep so that they can, they can swim over top of logs and things like that or bounce off the bottom but both have great action in the water. And like I said in the earlier, the last thing about these things is they are quite possibly two of the hardest baits to get here in the summer of 2020. I know we've had COVID, but this has taken getting lures to another level. These baits are almost impossible to get. And quite honestly, these are the two baits that are selling faster than any bait I've ever seen on the market. If we're gonna look at both of these lures, let's look at them really up close. The Jabberjaw overall size is 2.95 inches. The lure itself is 2.34 inches. The height of the lure is 1.1 inches and the width is 0.95 inches. The width of the bill of the Jabberjaw is 0.81 inches and it is 0.77 inches long. Now let's look at the axis. The overall size, including the bill, is 3.43 inches. The lure alone is 2.71 inches. Height is 1.12, and the width is 0.85 inches. The bill size of the axis is 0.9 inches from the top, and it is 1.17 inches long. Let's talk about some of the differences between the Access and the Jabberjaw. To start off, the Jabberjaw is much smaller with a more rounded profile compared to the Access, which has flat sides. The Jabberjaw has much smaller treble hooks. They're also a lot sharper. The Jabberjaw hooks are slightly turned in or more rounded, and that makes them stick into your fingers and other things quite well. The Jabberjaw's square bill is more rounded in the front and rounded on the edges too. The one big thing I noticed between the Axis and the Jabberjaw is the Jabberjaw bill doesn't rotate side to side as much as the Axis. The Axis square bill has more range or more movement to go back and forth side to side. Both these baits hunt completely different underwater. The Axis has a wider, broader range, a more erratic movement in the water. It has an extra wide wobble. Whereas the Jabberjaw has an erratic hunting action, but just not as wide, almost a little bit wider than your normal crankbait. And the biggest thing you're going to notice here is the sound between the Axis and the Jabberjaw. But let's just make it perfectly clear. The Axis has an internal rattle, where the Jabberjaw does not. But both lures were designed to sound like a metal clacking chatterbait. Let's just hear for ourselves. Level. 
Last but not least, the Access was released onto the market first, somewhere early 2020, to the Academy stores. The Jabberjaw was released to the public in early July 2020. The Sixth Sense Access is made in 26 colors, and retail price is $14.99. The Jabberjaw from 13 Fishing comes in 14 colors, and retail price is $11.99 each. I know which one is my favorite, but I'd love to hear which one you think is your favorite. So comment below and tell me what you think. Guys, thanks for watching. I don't know if you like these or want to see more of these comparisons, but if you do, just tell me and I'll try working on them. Hopefully you've subscribed, clicked that like button, comment, and click the notification bell so you know when the next video drops. Let's remember to do a few things. Take a kid fishing, get your fish on. We will see you soon. Cheers. Hey guys, thanks for watching. If you want to subscribe, click up here. If you want to see our last video, it should be right here. Take your kid fishing, get your fish on. Cheers.